All right, hole number nine, Frozen Valley. So I like to bring the middle chevron up to the corner of that rock there. Glide, skip, rive. Some hyzer. There's only one way to play this hole and that's go for the eagle. Hope you don't hit any trees or the mando or a ski lift pole. And hope for something like that where you got a shot at eagle. This hole is definitely aceable. It's happened. I'm sure a lot of people have done it. I've seen quite a few people do it. I don't think I've gotten it myself. I've gotten pretty close, but definitely one you can get an eagle, but it's also one you could easily miss the mando or go OB long. So you got to be a little bit careful. It's, a, it's good to have the same aiming point every time. So you, you get used to your wind adjustments and mine is just at the corner of that rock formation um, on the middle chevron this is looking pretty good the ideal wind is a right to left because it's going to help you hyzer back down towards the basket um, you can go long kind of right of the basket into those trees and end up OB um, and then you can also miss the mando of course but something like this that's not a very good skip sometimes you get unlucky skip like that but you can usually still salvage your birdie you just have to kind of throw it down there into the area of the basket and it kind of collects it down there to where you're within 70 feet or so or closer well this is kind of the riskiest line you can take and if you hit it just right it pays off something like this not super close but definitely close enough to give us an eagle try not to miss for y'all and make myself look stupid but there you go another eagle so pretty fun hole especially when you get that right to left um, you just start to hope that it doesn't hit anything and cut that corner nice and sharp and maybe you get lucky to get the ace a couple times I've gone long, like past the basket OB. It doesn't happen very often, but just keep that in mind as well. Um, this is looking... It's going to catch that rock. See, I've ended up up there OB or way to the left of the basket long and OB. But I'm sure there's a safe way to play this. You know, just take maybe a 10 or 11 speed. Or like a glide roll arrive and just throw it kind of halfway down the mountain and then throw it down to the basket for birdie but there's no fun in that and honestly if you get good at this glide skip shot you can get eagle pretty often i'm just going to throw it a few more times and see if we can come somewhat close to the basket oh give me a good bounce nope same stupid rock there but again, there's another easy eagle. 53 feet. I won't make this video too long. I'm not, definitely not gonna grind for the, the ace here. Maybe I'll get lucky, but we'll get the eagle for you a couple more times. This is cutting it real close. Oh, see? Sometimes you get all excited because it's a great line and then you get a dead skip like that end up stuck at the top but even from there it should be a pretty easy birdie gotten lucky a couple times and thrown it in for eagle from pretty far back this is looking pretty good sometimes you hit a chairlift as it's going up that's always the worst looks like this is going to sneak under the fence for another easy eagle 61 feet easy as pie all right so i thought i posted this video a while ago but i hadn't posted yet and i figured i'd add this one to it to the end this is hole one of the daily and this is the third time i've got this hole but uh wasted it each time i got it but it's still fun and wanted to add it to the end of this video showing you that it is possible to get that albatross there you go hope you enjoyed now we'll move on to the next course and appreciate y'all watching me play some DGV.